So we are at Dinosaur National Monument. And this section of it, we came in by, I think, the main visitor center? Yes, no? I don't know if it's the main one. Okay. It's one of the visitor one centers. Um, so we're doing the scenic drive right now. We're going to head to Echo Park Campground. And as I mentioned, tomorrow we've got a reservation to go on a tour of the quarry. So at least right now you have to book a specific time to go to the quarry. Uh, but really excited about this. It's, I didn't even know Dinosaur National Monument existed. This video is sponsored by Storyteller Overland. Live free, explore endlessly, and tell better stories. Yeah, it should be fun. I say since it is a 12 mile long dirt road, we air the tires down because it'll be 12 in, 12 out. Well worth taking the time to air down and have a nice smooth ride. Sounds or good. smoother. biggest watermelon she could find at the store today and it's probably going to take us a few days to get through that but not a cup of coffee it just sounds nice watermelon hot coffee i'm in okay I may need to trade the uh, cup of coffee for a beer. We have plenty of ice cold beer. Oh cool, look at this. Oh, I think this is the camp they were telling us about. Okay, quiz. What one thing did the settlers here have that I don't? Horses. A garage. <laughs> That's a garage? I think so. Yeah, this is the garage. I think that was the home. This is so cool. So 
that little stream, I'm guessing, is the reason this road is impassable during the rain. I'm assuming that in heavy rain, that'll fill up and you just can't get across it. Well, we've driven over several dry creeks. Yeah, this would be interesting in a heavy rainstorm. It is so beautiful out here, I just can't get over it. Yeah, I mean, look at that. Go check out the petroglyphs. Man, this place is cool. Think anyone will steal the truck? I don't think so. I haven't seen one person <laughs> since we hit this trail. Well worth the stop, thank you. Yes, that was really cool and unique. I'm just amazed that someone found that. Yeah, I mean, it's hard to see just standing in front of it. The air coming out of this thing is ice cold. feel about this. There's this like giant slab of rock. It's kind of freaky. I wouldn't mind sleeping in here. It's nice and cold. I would. I'd never be able to get to sleep. I'd be worried that I'd be die the whole time. Yeah. Let's see. Go deeper. Oh yeah, you just love them. Spelunking is your favorite pastime. This is a nice place to take a break and just cool down. Yeah. See, life without AC, you just have to find a cave. Yeah, no, I'll stay out of the caves. Okay, on to the campground. All right, do you think it's gonna be full? No. <laughs> Considering we haven't seen one person in the past few hours. My guess is there's probably a couple campers there. Always find a Subaru. Um, outside of that, I think it's gonna be fairly empty. A little tight in here. any spot. Oh, there's a pit toilet. Got your 10 bucks. All right. Off with you. It smells good in here. Well, I made my mind up. Figured I'll start with coffee and then I can work my way on to beer. Sure. I'm going for the watermelon. I can smell that over by the pay station. The coffee? Mm hmm. What are you making? This is Doma's Summer Lovin'. Kate and I are both feeling a bit icky after this drive today, so we decided to take a shower. However, we didn't quite have enough water in the tank, so there's a spout here. We were able to fill up our extra bladder, and we just pour it into the tank. And this half of this bladder is more than enough for two of us to take a shower. 
I don't know. I might take a long shower today. <laughs> of course you will. All right. I'm going to sit here, enjoy my coffee, maybe have a beer later, but this is a pretty awesome view. All right. Coffee for two. Thank you. You're welcome. So you're gonna drive us out today? I think so. Awesome. This is gonna be your first real like off-road driving. Mm-hmm. Well, usually I'm filming, but since it's same right, same road in and out, I figure I can drive us out. Yeah. For those of you wondering what this thing is, it is an Overlander French press. All the grounds get stored down here, so it makes it really easy to clean. If you're interested, I'll put a link in the description. You can go check it out. Cheers. Mm. What you up to? So, look at the rock ledge there, where the bushes are. There's that bush on the far left. Right above the bush, there are petroglyphs. One is of a mountain goat, and there's an archer shooting it. And then on the right, I think that's the bowl that the goat ended up in, or a pot. <laughs> I think we definitely found a spot we were going to want to come back to in the future. That water is very refreshing. Yes, but it's going to be a couple hour drive to the quarry, so we should get going. All right. Do you trust me to drive Leo out of here? Sure, why not? <laughs> Bumpy. Gotta find the rhythm. Still working on that. How's it feel off-roading Leo? Awesome. Leo's a beast. He is. He's so easy to drive. Yeah. Well, this is a this is a good road to start on. I mean, I we saw a Honda Accord coming down here. So. <laughs> well, all we need to see is a Prius, and the trip will be complete. Yes. <laughs> all right. Time to air us back up. Could you pop the hood for me? Sure. All set, thank you for your help. You're welcome. You. Let's go see some dinosaur bones. Okay, let's do it.
happy we came out here. Me too. So what do you say we go find a campsite for the night? Sounds good. Okay. I'll let you continue driving me around. I'm enjoying this. Boy, it is hot out, isn't it? I think we got to 90 or above today. Yep. Well, I noticed all the campgrounds are open, uh, but I would say let's go try Green River. Sounds good. Feels Perfect. Pretty level. Yeah, it's a nice spot. And we got flushing toilets and trash right yes. behind us. And I think we're going to have shade in a little bit. by the river or lake when it's summertime. Yes, quite nice. Well, now that I've cooled off in the river, I'm ready for a hot cup of coffee. We've still got some more stuff to see in Dinosaur National Monument, but if you're interested, you're gonna have to come here and see it yourself. We're not gonna give the whole park away. So that's it for this video. If you enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already. And if you wanna see more cool content in other national parks and monuments that we've been to, Check out wherethrussos.com and we'll see you next time. Bye. This video was brought to you by Storyteller Overland, who has been working to inspire and equip their growing community of road trippers, van lifers, off-roaders, and overlanders with the proper gear, resources, and mindset to live free, explore endlessly, and tell better stories out on the road and beyond. Head over to storytelleroverland.com to learn more.